So in this video, we're going to take a look at how you send your Solana coin from Binance to your Phantom wallet. So as you can see in my wallet on Phantom here, I don't have so many Solana, but I will go and transfer some from Binance to this wallet. So the first thing we have to do is to go to our profile here. Just click on the profile image. So when you're in here, you can see your balance. I have like 0 0.159 Solana. So I will go and send the most of them to my phantom wallet and the way we do it is by going to this withdraw button so click on that and from in here we want to select the coin that we want to send so in this case we just want to go and say sol and take solana we do then need to say which network do we want to send from and really when you send to the phantom wallet you want to send with the solana network itself but sometimes, as you can see with the other network here, you can see the network is suspended. So there will be in some cases where you are not able to go and withdraw it instantly. But as you can see right now, Solana is congested. So you should be able to do it. If it's a congested, it will just take a few minutes before the actual transaction have been taken place. But if the network is suspended, you have to wait. So I'll just go and click the Solana network. And as you can see here, it also comes with a warning that the network is congested and there is a risk that the withdrawal actually don't succeed. But let's go and try it anyway. So the last thing we actually need here is our address that we want to send it to. So you have to go to your phantom wallet, go and click on the receive. And then we want to go and use the Solana network. So just go and click Solana and you can go and copy your public address here. So go and copy it and paste it into the address. So I actually just found out that you have to have at least 0 0.5 Solana before you can send it out of Binance. So that's not so cool right now because I really want to go and send this, but then I just have to go and insert some more money to buy some more solana so i can go to 0 0.5 solana but really what you want to do then if you have enough you have just to go and say how much do you want to send and then say withdraw then the transaction will start and within a few minutes you should be able to see the solana in your phantom wallet so it actually came as a surprise for me that the minimal was so high and you can also see you have to pay a small fee so it is 0 0.01 solana and i do think that it's actually one of the downsizes with binance that you have to actually pay this much in fee because when you just go to your phantom wallet and you send Solana out of your Phantom wallet, then it is not this expensive. So I do believe that this is just because Binance also want to have a share of the actual transaction. If we just scroll down here, you can go and see your recent withdrawals. So you can see I actually put 0 0.5085 Solana to my phantom wallet just recently and i can see i have been very lucky because i didn't see the 0 0.5 was the minimal so i actually just sent a little bit over 0 0.5 but now you also know that this is the minimum it can of course have been changed when you see this video but i hope you learned something and else go and have a nice day bye